And I'm just gonna span around so you can see this beautiful property and the neighborhood. So here is your view of the driveway and you're at the end of a cul-de-sac here, so you really don't have any neighbors. Your mailbox is down to the left side, right over there. And as you can see, you really don't have any neighbors at all around you, which is really wonderful. All right, so let's head up inside and have a look. It's super peaceful and beautiful here. Now, before we head inside, I'm just going to walk over here. There's the front entrance. And I'm just gonna walk over to the side so you can see where the three car garage is located. The views are just endless here. So here's your three car garage. Look at how beautiful this is. It's just such a beautiful property. So here's the side view. Okay, let's just head back to the front door and we'll head on inside. So here's the entry. It's so beautiful. I really love all the details. Just so pretty. And in here you have a little, it could be like a little wine cellar or just another little storage area. It's really cute. Has a little light inside. I didn't turn it on though. Look at your living space right here. It's so pretty. I really love this. Okay, so I'm just gonna head to the right. And off to the right, you have a little closet. Right outside, it's a coat closet. Right outside the bathroom, it's a little half bath that's located right outside of this bedroom space. Also close to the kitchen. It looks like they had their bed up here. That's really interesting. And here's a little walk-in closet. And your bathroom this is for your guest bathroom. Let me just turn around here. This looks like it was made for a king bed. We'll just head back through. It's a really lovely room. I love that you have the sliding doors right off of here to the brick, nice patio outside. Look at the views from this window, just really stunning. You do have the sunset views from here, which is really wonderful. It's a nice little space inside this bedroom. Okay, so let's head back down towards the entry. There's the entry where I just came in. We're gonna keep walking straight. Here's another little area, which looks like it could be your formal dining room space, if that's what you wish, or it could be another TV room. And let's just head this way into the kitchen space. What a lovely kitchen, it's huge. I love that you have this area to put a nice table for your kitchen. These views are just really beautiful. And look at the outside patio. We'll go out there in just a little bit. I love that you have a fireplace in the kitchen area. And wow, this kitchen is gorgeous. My apologies, I forgot to turn on the lights, but it looks like you have a microwave, lots of storage in here. I love this cooktop. And I like that you have the extra 
uh, pot filler right here. That's really nice. Plenty of storage space in this kitchen. Looks like your dishwasher is located right there, right by your sink. And we'll head into this door space, which is the garage. So here's your three car garage. Nice and spacious, plenty of room in here. It's a nice big garage. All right, so let's head back through the kitchen. And we're just gonna go upstairs and check out the upstairs space. I love the chandeliers and all the lighting. It's just so nice. Okay, I'm gonna turn to the right and we're gonna head into this bedroom. This bedroom looks like it has a nice balcony. Really get to see the views from this balcony. It's really pretty. This room size is a little bit smaller, so it would take a queen bed easily. And let's head in here. Looks like you have another bedroom right here. Let me just stand over in this corner. Actually, this, this is not a bedroom technically. This could be like a nice sitting area right off of the bedroom space. Here's your closet, a nice walk-in closet. And your bathroom, your full-size tub and shower. Just one little vanity. This is a great room, beautiful views. This room overlooks the front area. Would be a really nice sitting room. And back through, I guess it could be two bedrooms together because there is one closet, my apologies. So let's just go over that again. So here's the bedroom. And then there's the other bedroom. So I guess you could technically share this closet space right here for the two bedrooms. So that could work for kids. And we'll head back out of the two bedrooms behind me. We're gonna walk over this direction. Looks like you have another TV room space right here. That could be really nice. And right off of the TV space to the left is your washer dryer. Looks like they're brand new washer and dryers. Plenty of storage in there. I love that. And we'll just head straight into this bedroom. A nice full-size bathroom off of this bedroom too. Let me just span around. This bedroom could easily fit a queen bed, maybe bigger. Here's your bathroom space. Looks like another a tub shower. That's wonderful. One sink. And we'll head out of here into the next room, which is your big master. It is gorgeous. You have these two double doors right here. I really love that. And directly to the right is your big master bathroom, which is absolutely gorgeous. You have two sinks, this beautiful bathtub overlooking these views. Oh, it's really beautiful. I love it. And you have a fireplace from both sides. So let's just look at that from the other angle. Beautiful walk-in shower with the big rain head at the top. Looks like it's two shower heads. How wonderful is that? And your toilet space right behind the closed door. And look at this master, it is ginormous. 
I love this. And look at the fireplace. Oh, it's so nice. Here it is from this side. You can have a look at the bathtub through there. And you have your own balcony right here off of the master. I'm just gonna stand over in this far corner so you can get a better view of how big this master is. You could have two king beds in here. And this overlooks the park extra parking you have right outside of the garage space. Again, your views are amazing. No neighbors right near you at all. It's really wonderful. Okay, so let's head into the master closet and have a look in here. Looks like a little sitting area right there. And here's your master closet. This is quite big and it looks like it comes with a safe, which is really great. This is a very big master closet, I like it. And we're gonna head back out of the master Back around, remember we have the bedroom upstairs right here, your washer and dryer straight ahead, your TV area possibly, and heading back over to the other two bedrooms that had the shared closet. We're gonna go back downstairs. And we'll head outside and check out the backyard space. Now oh, here's the backyard space. There's the one bedroom down below that I first showed you, the bedroom up above. It's just so beautiful here and so peaceful and quiet. And here's the side little walkway that goes around to the front. And we'll just head over to this side. This is right off of the kitchen space. And then up above is your master. And those windows are in the kitchen and the windows up above are where the bathroom, the, the big tub is. Okay, so let's just keep going. And this goes right around to the driveway space where I showed you the three car garage. And we'll just go over there so you can have another look. So there's that. That is just, just such a beautiful property. All right, well, that concludes my tour. I hope you will join me and apply ahead of time if you feel you like what you've seen on this video. Thank you so much and look forward to seeing you. Bye-bye.